We know DeMar Hamlin suffered a cardiac arrest after taking a hit on the field, and there have been a number of possible causes thrown out there since. Doctors I talked to today went into detail on what we're hearing, but said it will probably be a while until we know exactly what happened. DeMar Hamlin's family is speaking out through a statement released today. Quote, your generosity and compassion mean the world to us. Please keep DeMar in your prayers. We will release updates as soon as we have them. The 24-year-old Buffalo Bills safety is still in the intensive care unit at UC Medical Center in Cincinnati, where he was rushed last night after collapsing on the field after a hit to the chest. Many speculating on what led up to Hamlin suffering cardiac arrest, saying it could have been something called commotio cordis, a disruption of the heart's rhythm. For the timing and the direction and the position of the trauma is said just right that it can disrupt the cardiac rhythm. That's Dr. Robert Bono, a cardiologist with Northwestern, explaining what commotio cordis is and how rarely it's reported. There's a, a, somewhere between 500 to 1,000 cases that have been reported uh, overall. And so it's in, in the ballpark of uh, 20 to 30 cases per year. It's conceivable there could be other causes here. A number of other causes. Dr. Sean Swearingen, a cardiologist specializing in sports medicine with Rush, told us the same thing. It could be just as likely that he just happened to have a cardiac event related to something else. Explaining with a focus on his physical recovery, it could be a while before doctors can run the extensive number of tests it would require to determine what happened. Until that testing is completed, it's nothing that could be, uh, you know, remotely definitive. Both experts telling us any possible cause being thrown out there right now is just that, a possibility. Problem right now, major challenge right now is his neurologic status. Both doctors we talked to reinforce the importance of quick reaction. In this case, the use of a defibrillator and continuous CPR, something they say should be taught in every level of sports. Both thinking of DeMar Hamlin and his family today, still in critical condition with a road ahead. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Tara Molina, CBS2 News.